Hey everybody, this is the Glider Cat and it's time to play. Today I have an early preview for a train-based city builder called Sweet Transit. Now Glider Cat subscribers may recall that I first featured Sweet Transit on the channel way back in June of 2021. You're seeing some footage from that original video here. However, if you're just now learning about Sweet Transit, you may want to subscribe to the channel so you can learn about cool upcoming games just like this one months before other channels feature them. Now, since I posted that earlier video, a lot has been happening with Sweet Transit. A few months ago, the developer announced they've signed on with a publisher. It's Team 17. They've published uh, dozens of games, so they're a pretty big publisher in the gaming space. Uh, there's also a brand new game trailer that came out a few months ago. We're going to take a look at that in a minute. And there's going to be a closed beta running from April 27th through May 4th, 2022. I sent, uh, I, I made a post uh, forwarding the sign up for that to subscribers. You should have gotten that. If not, check the community tab. I'm not sure if it's going to still be open uh, when this video posts. Hopefully there'll be more opportunities to play. This is the first opportunity to play that I'm aware of. Now I'll be posting a new Let's Play Sweet Transit series featuring content from that closed beta shortly after this video posts. So stay tuned for that. Now let's take a look at that new game trailer I mentioned. Then we'll come back and talk a bit about what Sweet Transit is all about. Here we go with the trailer. I am never sure of time or place upon a railroad. I can't breathe. I can't think. I can't sleep. I can only dream. Rattling along in this railway carriage in a state of luxurious confusion. I take it for granted I am coming from somewhere and going somewhere else. I seek to know no more. I know nothing about myself. For anything I know, I may be coming from the moon. Why things come into my head and fly out again, whence they come and why they come, where they go and why they go, I am incapable of considering. It may be the guards' business or the railway companies. I only know it is not mine. Sweet Transit, launching into Early Access 2022. All right, that was the trailer. I really, really like the voice acting in that. I think it's kind of unique, pretty cool. Now, one of the things that makes Sweet Transit unique from other transit games is that there are no other means of transportation in the game other than trains. There's no trucks, there's no planes, there's no boats. It's all about the trains. Now, you'll be using them to move people between factories and towns, as well as using them to move all of the different products that your factories are going to produce. Another unique aspect of Sweet Transit is that you only get to have a single warehouse, and that's intentional. It means that you're likely going to have to use your head to map out exactly how you want to develop your various transit lines and cities, given the landscape and the location of your one and only warehouse. You can probably imagine how that's going to produce some logistical challenges as you get bigger and bigger. Now, on the city builder side of the game, you have citizens to care for, and those citizens have needs. If you neglect those needs, you're going to have a hard time finding workers for your various lines of production, and your growth will likely stall. It's kind of, kind of a typical dynamic in city builder games. And as your initial villages grow into cities, so will the needs of your citizens. And you're going to have to scale up your operations to keep everything in balance, again, with that single warehouse. So we'll see how that goes. As you play, you're also going to be moving through the different eras of trains from steam to diesel. Um, all of the trains that I've seen so far in the game just look really cool, as does the entire game world, as you can see here in this footage. You can customize each of your trains with just about any color you can think of, and there are tools for organizing them as well as all of your various train routes. Now, I've managed to play a little of the preview version of the game before recording this video, and it's all been very, very smooth and very, very intuitive. You can tell a lot of work has gone into the game. It plays very smooth. 
Now, I'll keep this initial preview short since we're going to see some actual gameplay during the Let's Play season uh, that I'll soon be posting to the Gladder Cat channel. Mainly want to get this uh, get this game, Sweet Transit, on your radar in the event you missed that first video of it back in June 2021. Before we wrap up, though, I do want to mention that Sweet Transit is being built with mod support from day one. That is a huge, huge plus. If you're familiar with modding, and especially with games like this, then you can just imagine all the cool content that the community is likely to create for Sweet Transit. The game Voxel Tycoon comes to mind. Also featured that on the channel some months ago. It's another new train game, and there are already over 150 mods for it. So hopefully we'll see the same with Sweet Transit. I expect we will. It's very, very cool to have mod support. Really extends the gameplay, and a lot of creative stuff comes out of the community. Now, Sweet Transit is currently shown as being a single-player game, and I haven't heard of any plans to support multiplayer. I guess we'll see long-term. Some single-player games do eventually add uh, multiplayer, but I'm not sure if there's any plans to do that. I'll put a bunch of links in the description of this video so you can check out the Sweet Transit Steam page and maybe add it to your wish list and follow if it's a game you think you might be interested in. I'll also put a link to the game's Discord server. There's a lot of good discussion there about the game and you can uh, communicate with the developer directly. And that wraps up this quick preview of Sweet Transit. Again, I'll be posting a Let's Play for the game featuring the closed beta content very soon on the channel, so stay tuned for that. And my thanks goes out to GladderCat channel supporters. I'm talking about channel members, and patrons. If you would like to help support this content, you can find links to do so in the description, and I would appreciate it greatly. It's that kind of funding and backing that helps make this content possible. Also, I'll put a link to my first look playlist. I highly recommend at least browsing that playlist to find some very cool upcoming games, just like Sweet Transit. I'm confident if you look through that list, you will find something interesting that you haven't yet heard about. I tend to research a lot of games and the gems get put into that list. So definitely take a look at that. And with that, this is GladderCat saying thanks so much for watching, and I will see you in the next one.